What's up guys? Welcome back to another one of my escapades and today we are gonna go do kind of a historic walk. I'm here with my boy Omar Gosh. So in 1996 Tupac Shakur was gunned down at the corner of Koval and Flamingo Avenue, I think it's Avenue. We did come last night to try to go and look but it was freezing cold. It's too cold. Way too cold. Way it's still too cold. cold. It is still cold. <laughs> We were freezing though, so we're back in the daytime. We're gonna go check out his memorial at the location that he was gunned down. So let's go check it out, see what it's all about. See what it's all about. And see what it's all about. Let's go. Anything, but you got your spirit I box. Do, yeah, I do got the spirit box. I mean, we gotta go over there across the street. That's where the memorial is. <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard him say that. It says that. Yeah. It's like wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> you can make a pizza on a real thing. You got a white pole here. Yeah. And the bottom right there. Look at that painting. Oh yeah. What kind of paintings are there? I'm taking a look at it. Okay. So there was a tourist. He's that way. He was like, hey, you should go across the street. There's like this pole with a ton of, you know, like graffiti on it. So I don't think he even knew exactly what it was, too. <laughs> it's a memorial to Tupac. Now, Tupac was just leaving a fight, a Mike Tyson fight. I guess he was really good friends with Mike Tyson. And he won the fight, by the way. I think he was in the first round. Oh, bro, look at this, man. That's one of the homeless people. He was telling me. There was we should give him something. Oh, there's one over there. Wow. Bro, it is cold out here. It is cold, cold out here. So cold. So in 1996, Tupac was right here and it was on a stoplight and a Cadillac pulled up to their BMW. I think Suge Knight was driving. Yes. And he was shot up. He was the only one to die too. Who, did somebody else get shot? No, just him. So he was the only one that got shot. It was just him. There's a lot of conspiracies online. I mean, I'm not sure what to believe, what to believe but... One thing I will say is, uh, I mean, based on what I know happened, because there was a lot of like, you know, East Coast, West Coast, beef, 
you know, of course, you know, Biggie Smalls passed away shortly after. I mean, I lived through this. I seen what was going on. I believe that he was alive still, but there was tons of talk music coming out after his death. But, I mean, it's, it's pretty confirmed that he is, he is gone. And, you know, rest in peace, Pop. One of my favorite rappers of all time. What had happened was, is he was at an MGM. I think it was at the fight. It was, right? it was right after the fight. Right after the right fight. Right after the fight. In so, the lobby. Uh, he had some ties uh, to the Bloods, and what happened was he's like one of his boys. I guess he was drunk by some crew members, and they noticed him there at the MGM Grand, and they jumped him. And then after that, they wanted to get revenge. Long story short, they pulled up next to him here and shot him. And yeah, I guess Tupac had punched the guy in the face. So that's that's what happened, right? I'm not yeah. sure exactly if that's the full story. Yeah, Tupac punched him in the face. Anderson. It was Anderson. His name was Anderson. Yeah, his right? name was Anderson. But this guy had he had jumped another blood member, like stealing his chain. Yeah, he stole his chain. Anderson had stolen stolen Tupac's chain, and was Tupac. It Tupac? No, it was like Tupac one of Tupac's friends. Was it the friends? Yeah. There's a chain right there, actually. Oh, is there? Yeah, there's a chain right there. I just saw. Oh wow, there is. But he stole one of. What his... if that was the chain? <laughs> that was the chain yeah. that was stolen. He stole a Bloods chain, and what happened was Tupac pointed him out in the lobby after the fight, and then Tupac punched him in the face, and the rest of the Bloods came up and then stomped Anderson out in the lobby. Wow. And then after that, Anderson and the Crips came after Tupac. And they were following him here. Yeah. Yeah. But look, there's all kinds of cool things here for Tupac, and a lot of people drive and walk past this, and they don't even realize this. This is from the four Tupac. I mean, we're a legend. There's a picture of him. How cool is that? There's a picture of him down there? Yeah, somebody drew a picture of him. Oh, that's pretty cool, dude. Well, look at all, all the way up, up there. Nice. See, they're on the tree, too. Did you see all the writing on the tree? Yeah. So much. That's really cool. So I've read a lot of stories online that Tupac does come and visit this memorial site. And he died right here. So uh, we're gonna try to make communication with Tupac. You know it sounds crazy, it's loud out here, but I got a pretty loud speaker. I'm gonna turn it up all the way. And we're gonna pay our respects too. But it's a penny there. That's cool. Hey, I got one. It's two pennies for the eyes, right? I got no penny. You know how you put two pennies on the eyes and when you bury people? Uh, it's for the for the ferry man. The ferry man needs two cents to get you past. Well, what's up, bro? You want to do a quick spare box right here? Yeah, let's do it. Right, please bear with us. It's loud out here, but I mean, I don't know. Where is Tupac even buried? I think that'd be a great place to do a spare box. I'm not sure. Where he's buried? Let us know in the comments if that's something that you want us to do. Maybe go out, out there, but I mean, a lot of people that know who Pac was, they don't know the, the location, it's right here. Yeah. If you ever come out to Vegas, come pay your respects. Pretty cool if you're a ghost hunter, do a spirit box communication. I want to reach out and ask, because I mean, there's a lot of, even till this day, there's a lot of questions surrounding his death. There's a lot of conspiracy theories as to, you know, maybe it was a setup. Because he was the only one that died. He was the only one that died. What do you think? I don't know. It's kind of sketchy since he was the only one that died. I think we should ask. Alright. Alright, let's ask. Let's do it. Look at that skill. I don't know if it's going to stay. <laughs> it's staying in. It? it is. I got my camera in the tree right now. That tree that I was showing you, I got... He'll be able to show it. Whatever you do, don't bump into the, into the tree, though. A $2,000 camera is dangling from the tree. Well, I don't know if we're going to be able to hear anything. I don't know if we are, but you got a pretty loud speaker. That's I'm going to turn it loud. all the way up. All right. We can put it close to the cameras, too. That way, when we edit, we'll be able to hear it. Oh, no! Bad idea! <laughs> Very bad idea! <laughs> Okay, let's not do that again. No, is it okay? Yeah. Okay, that's good. <laughs> oh, by the way, thank you, Oh My Gosh TV, for letting me use his camera. Because my camera, 
My camera's dead. My camera is dead, dead. We could get right down in here. It'd probably be less windy right here, huh? Yeah, bud. Oh, <laughs> We're not old at all. What the hell? Oh. Oh. Oh yeah. <laughs> We're, I don't know, maybe, maybe 15 feet away from where Pop died. So we're gonna go ahead and open up the app that I use for spirit box communication. If you want to try this app out for yourself, I have a link down below in the description. It's pretty awesome. It's great for spirit communication. I don't know. I hope this works out. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna just. I'm gonna crank it up. That was kind of loud. Yeah. I'm gonna move my speaker all the way up. Well, oh, Tupac, are you here with us? Yeah. Is there anything you want to tell us? From the other side? We really appreciate your music that you left behind for us. I can't hear anything. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what I'm hearing. What happened? Dead? That's what I heard, dead. I know, but who killed you? Conflict? Conflict? Is that what she said? I don't know. Or that female voice? Was it a cover up? Or are the stories true? What was the guy's name that murdered you? Was it somebody you knew that killed you? We sure do miss you. Do you come and visit this memorial? A lot of love is here for you. I mean, how long ago did that happen? 96? 96. What was your favorite song that you sang? One. One? I know which one. Your favorite song? so hard to hear. It's hard to hear, yeah. You guys are probably hearing more of what we're hearing because I have the speaker right up to the microphone. I'm a little bit more away, but yeah. if you can't hear it on my video, head on over to his video too and go see if you can hear it better on his video. Yeah, I'll put it a little closer. Alright, here we go. Drop it in the middle. Drop. It's much closer now. We want to hear from you, Tupac. Dream. No, it's not a dream. And I'm sorry it's not. Was there a song called Dream? Oh, maybe. I don't know. There are a lot of songs I even hear that Tupac has made. He made so many songs. Is Tupac alive? Yes. I always felt like Tupac was alive, though. Tom? Come on. Faith? Did you die because of Faith? Faith was Biggie's wife. Oh, really? Yeah. There, there, was, there was a thing going on. Was that real? The beef that you had with, with Biggie? Was that real beef? 
Or was it that just like a publicity stunt? What happened on that night? 1996, September. Would you like for us to visit your grave instead? Go somewhere quieter, okay? Yeah, come on. Okay, so my buddy Omar here, he had a great idea. And that was to go back to that intersection since it was so noisy over there. We're gonna go back to the intersection in the car and see if we can stop at the red light where Park was gunned down. We should do a couple passes. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah. Oh, hang out the red light, you know, when it turns green, go back and go back again. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah, screw it. That's where we're headed right now, but outside this window. It's cold. It is cold. <laughs> There's also an amazing Ferris wheel. Oh my god. Right? I want to light up at the top and ride it down. That looks like an amazing time. Let me know if you guys have ever rode that Ferris wheel before. How high does it go? Does anybody know how high it goes? <laughs> how high did you go? <laughs> section I'm just hoping we get a red light uh, I'm gonna stay in the middle lane because that's where they were so see that's where we were right there the memorials on the right hand side all right Tupac we can hear you now are you here with us oh there's two memorials mm -hmm. oh I didn't even know that there was another one back there we missed Alright, here we go. Okay, we're right in front of it. That's where we were earlier. Right there. Right there. So what exact- <gasps> It said they shot me! Did it really? Yeah! Whoa! Who shot you? Who shot you? Light just turned around. I'm gonna do another U-turn. We're gonna come back around. Yeah, we're gonna come back around. Yeah. This is good. Yeah, that was cool. At the intersection, a little bit further away from the memorial, but we're gonna turn back around and go a lot closer to the memorial, but we're still gonna do some EVPs while we're here at this light because we're just a few steps away. So, all right, Pac, talk to us. It was him. It was him. I heard that too. Yeah. Who was it that killed you? Wow. No. Was it gang related? Yes. Yes. Was it? The, was it the Crips? What was his name? Whoa! Did you, it kind of said Anderson. Really? Yeah, it kind of said Anderson. It was like Anderson. Alright, we're going right through the intersection. Mm -hmm. Didn't Suge Knight have an affiliation with the Bloods too? He was Blood. Oh, he was Blood. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. yeah. Wow. Look, that's where... It happened right up there. Do you, do you regret what happened? Do you, do you feel like it could have been avoided? Yeah. <sighs> 
kingdom. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do another E turn. We're getting some good responses. This was much better doing it like this. Yeah, much warmer too. And it's warmer. <laughs> for sure. It's so windy out there. As he turns up my side of the car. <laughs> See, look, this is where we could have parked, but it's an employment, employment center. So I, I'm still not sure. I mean, I I believe Tupac has passed away, but I mean, is there a possibility of, of him maybe possibly faking his death? People did talk about that a lot when he died. He would have been seen by now. Yeah. Tupac, may you rest in peace, bud. You got a lot of people that love you. Is there anything you want to say to us? Is there anything you want to say from the other side to us? Maybe to all your fans watching? Do you like the, the, the memorial that they did for you here? It's still here. Wow. Yeah, a lot. We're gonna make a U-turn and get a little closer now. We, we might be able to, we might be picking up different spirits at this point. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, there's another pole there. Okay, we're here again. Right in front of it. What happened here? <laughs> Is the story true? I know I keep asking, but I want confirmation. Was there a scuffle? No. Conspiracy? Who wanted you dead? Can you repeat that? Are you resting in peace, Tupac? I want you to rest in peace. Do you feel like justice was served when it came to your murder? No. No, no it said no. It said no. It said no. Again. Crime. Let's go again. I'm going to leave it at that. We're going to try to figure out where Pac is buried. It's, it's one thing that I've never... I mean... It, was he cremated? Was he actually buried? I'm not sure. I didn't know that Tupac, uh, up until maybe earlier this year, that he was actually gunned down in Vegas. Yeah, I, I always thought it was like L.A. for some reason. I don't know why. Um, I, I knew it was out west. But anyways, let let us know what you what you think you heard. Maybe some of the EVPs that we picked up. We picked up some good stuff in the car right now. We did. Yeah, we that was great. Good responses. If you're ever in Vegas, be sure to check out the memorial. Pay your respects. Bring a sharpie with you too. That way you can draw on the pole. I would recommend drawing on the other one that we missed because yeah. we didn't have that many on that one. The one further down. Yeah, the one a little bit further down. I can't believe I missed that. But anyways, make sure to check out my boy Aiden with Aiden's yeah. Escapades. He has a pretty lit channel, and he recorded some stuff that I didn't record tonight, too. So, why am I saying tonight? Yeah, it's starting to get dark out, and it's starting to get cold. But, yeah, um, 
Also, I would recommend maybe bring in like some water or maybe a bag of chips for some of the homeless people that are right there. I'm they were very friendly and I, I don't know. I, I could see that they were hungry and they were cold. I wish I would have had a blanket so or something. Cold. Because yeah, they're they're pretty cold. Homeless situation here in Vegas is ridiculous. Alright guys, well that's gonna do it for tonight. Well, I did the same thing. See tonight, because it's getting night. Yeah. Today's adventure. <laughs> I hope that you guys did enjoy looking at the memorial and watching the memorial. It was bad. And yes. watching us freeze our asses off. Yeah. Smash that like button, all the new people to the channel. Don't forget to hit the subscription button and the bell notification icon so you don't miss the next escapade. And don't forget to check out my boy Omar's channel as well. But as for now, I'm out of here.